We praying that she's still alive and that someday she'll come back. It was April 30th, 2010, Ariana Peaches Davis disappeared. It's devastating, you know, to go every day, every day wondering where your child is or is she okay when you can't get to her. Prime suspect of this case, T1 Holland, was last seen actually around the house of Miss Davis. And he was last seen pulling out of the driveway and heading possibly in the direction of that express mart. Enrico police believe Tawan Holland is connected to three violent crimes. His DNA hit that 2007 murder. My son said hi to him and he pulled off. I'm like, well, what was he doing here? So Tawan's brother tells investigators he knows what happens to Ariana Peaches Davis. Ariana was just a pleasant person to be around. She was the laughter in our family. She kept us happy. I miss her hugs, her smile, her energy, um, her love she brought to the family. Um, I just miss holding her. It was April 30th, 2010, Ariana Peaches Davis disappeared. Her brother came home and I was in the room sleep and Peaches was upstairs when I thought, you know, she was before I fell asleep and her brother came in and he was like, well, mom, where is Peaches? Police believe Ariana was going a few blocks over to a convenience store. However, she left her personal things like her wallet at home, so things weren't adding up. In 2017, uh, mom tells me that Henrico police came by with a DVD. And of course, they showed the DVD to the family. At first, only Lawrence could watch it because Zandra was having a hard time with it. And Lawrence said it was then they learned about the Tijuana Holland connection to this case. The prime suspect of this case, Tijuana Holland, was last seen actually around the house of Miss Davis. Um, and he was last seen pulling out of the driveway and heading possibly in the direction of that express mart. So Tawan Holland dated a relative of Ariana's. They had broken up, but the day that Ariana disappeared, her brother said he saw Tawan parked in the driveway. Uh, and when he went out to say hi, he kind of rolled the window up fast and pulled off without him acknowledging him. Enrico police believe Tawan Holland is connected to three violent crimes. Mr. Holland was convicted for a vicious attack on a young lady, wherein during the course of this attack, uh, the young lady was stabbed numerous times uh, in what the Commonwealth argued was an attempt to kill her. Uh, she was placed in a bathtub where uh, she was going to be uh, either left for dead and or he was going to you know, finish her off there. And by a miracle of miracles, that young lady was able to uh, free herself from the situation when Mr. Holland had left the apartment and was able to, to get help. And when he was arrested, a DNA swab was taken from him. His DNA hit that 2007 murder. So Tawan's brother tells investigators he knows what happens to Ariana Peaches Davis because his brother mentioned something about a dumpster and putting her body in the dumpster and those remains will be in a landfill. Ariana Peaches Davis is still missing without a trace. We praying that she's still alive and that someday she'll come back. It's devastating, you know, to go every day, every day, wondering where your child is or is she okay when you can't get to her to comfort her or to tell her that you love her. We have no evidence to suggest that she is still alive. We've never received any information that she has been spotted anywhere else, which is sometimes what you see in some of these you know, missing persons cases, particularly for young people who have been abducted and they, are, they, they come back out and we find them you know, 10, 20 years later. We have no evidence that such has happened to Miss Davis. So we have been working with the family to let them know that we are treating this as a homicide and uh, continue to treat it as one of our open cases. To see mom's face 
and to see her cry like she did when I walked into the house. Uh, it would mean a lot if someone could step forward and put the final piece of the puzzle together so police can do their job and bring charges against whoever killed uh, Ariana Peaches Davis. You know, I pray that God speak to someone's heart to speak out. I miss her like crazy. <laughs> It's my baby.